Also, I should go fix my fucking sword before I head up to Skellige. I don't know what it's gonna be like. Trumpet. Mm. Trumpet is a funny word. Whoa, wrong hit. Okay. Huh? Yakuza Zero the remake. I mean, Yakuza Zero was just Yakuza Zero. The remake is Kiwami. Greetings, Ibeer. Greetings, Geralt. How might I be of help? Uh, I need you to fix Listen. this shit for me. Yeah, re just repair what I've got equipped, please. Thank you. Ooh! Hold on. You might just have the shit I need. No, you don't. I might have some stuff that would make me Dimitri. Look at you. Right the shit. Uh, Dimitri. I don't even have any glowing ore ingots. <sighs> Stay lovey. So long. Kubami, yeah, 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 the remake. Okay. Shoot me calls. And thank you, Bruce. Again, I have the uh, original creator um, posted in the comments, and I did ask him specific permission whether I could use it. So he's good with me using that music, and it is very charming. Got this cracking in my spine. Looking to make some I am going to have to learn how to play Mahjong at some point. <laughs> I understand it's like similar. Similar to poker? Oh god, stop breathing. Please stop breathing or I will just kill you all. Jesus Christ. Hello. You captain of this tub? Uh, What's it to you? I'm Skellige bound. Need to get there. Start swimming. Islanders, the black ones, all attackers in those waters. No one sails the route these days. No oh, Come shit. on. Clans are ready to deal. Leave you alone if you do. Someone's done it. Gotta have. Not likely. Except maybe that daft bastard Wolverston from the Atropos. A liar, a thief, and a bugger, that one. He might have parlayed with the sea swine. Already? Mm -hmm. Where can I find him? In a pigsty most times. Others, the golden sturgeon. Ask for Flask. Everyone knows him. Alrighty then. Guess we're going to the golden sturgeon. That's an excellent pub name. Ah. Mahjong Soul. Is that like a game on Steam? <laughs> Would you all please stop making such horrific noises? You, Wolverston, captain of the Atropos. So you wanna know if I'm Atropos, captain of the Wolverston? <laughs> no fucking clue, mate. I need to get to Skellige. My Atropos and me, we're due to sail for our Skellig, carrying grain. But that's our shush. Holy shit, how drunk is Got this guy? Got any coin? A thousand? Gotta get more coin. You sure do. For I won't even whip me horse in a bath without payment in advance. Not a human, are you? Look for your kind beyond the walls. Jesus. You're back. Fucking hell. Yeah. That enough? Mm. Hefty sack. Like a bull's. Ugh. When do we sail? Not sure you're ready. You can barely stand. Know this, stranger. Captain Wolverston never sails sober. The sea goes one way, Wolverston the other. Makes the rock unbearable. Fair enough. So, ready to set sail? Aye, let's go. 
Let's go. Ah, first, we must drink to the wind, to good fortune, and to the strength of my Atropos. Alrighty. Anchors away. <laughs> Funny, such a funny fucking guy. All right, girl. Humans don't trust non humans. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Christ. Jesus. Oh, boy. <laughs> Let's go. And so, and so, uh, Geralt was killed. Jesus Christ, dude. Hello. Back off or I'll kill you. <laughs> I'm not afraid of dying. See, I've landed on Ord Skellig. How you figure that? You're wearing clan on crate colors. Ord Skellig's their island. Yeah. On the Atropos, were you? Yeah. Thought the captain had a deal with you. With us? Meaning who exactly? Might have arranged something with Lugos, but crack. Nay. Crack. Clearly should have, though. Outlander ships aren't welcome in these waters. What about you? What do you seek in Skellige, eh? Agreed to meet a sorceress here. Yennefer of Vengerberg. She's supposed to be on Ord Skellig. There's a witch a care trolda. Croc's guest. Could be the one you're meeting. Go then. That scorn I hear in your voice. You've good ears. Folks say this witch has got Croc wrapped around her finger. Orders everyone about. Word is she's vicious at it, but a hag's a hag. Seen her? Know what the sorceress looks like? Aye. Where's black and white? If not for her tits, you'd think she was a beached orca. Fact yeah. is, even those who see her for a wench should gladly push her out to sea, tits and all. I'm gonna slap. What's your name? Staingrim. Well, Stangrim, I don't like you. In fact, I feel like slapping you. Go ahead, Drifter. You try. Look for mercy! <laughs> Had enough? Fucked. Best finish me now. Cause you'll be fucked once I catch my breath. It was a good fight. That's enough for now. 
Know the way to Kertrolda? No. I expect I'll find it. No. Head north. Then turn west towards the bay before you come to the bridge. You'll find the Jarl port site today. Your sorceress ought to be there too. Thanks. Reckon. So long. Let us doggo. Trofast. Aww. I wonder if that captain's still alive somewhere. That ship got fucked. Oh, dragons! Hold on, let's let's go and uh, get some of their attention. I need to kill some of them. Fuck you! Fuck you! Yo, fight me! There we go. I'm assuming they're Draconids. Monster Brain. Oh. That's not weird, that's just very British culture, to be honest. They're like women with myself. dragon parts attached. Uh oh! Well, that's unsettling. I don't like it. I'm gonna kill all of them immediately. They're not a draconid, though. They're a hybrid. Interesting. <laughs> Siren Den. Gotta ruin it for them. Get fucked, lads. Oh, there's another one. Oh, is that a named one? Bobby, bitch. Wait, no, that is a dragon, I think. No, that's a, that's a siren. It's hard to tell from a fucking distance. Echidna. Damn, you're ugly. Damn, you're ugly. Mm, magic. A place of power. You're ugly. Do, 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 do. I keep referencing that, I can't stop myself, it's funny. Ooh. Nice. Joe, Joe. Go on, man. What, the chocolates, Maverick? Meteorite Silver Ingot. Sick.
Yeah, I need to go hunt some more Draconids to get my uh, wolf armor finished. I am excited for getting it finished. Like, hell yeah. Can't I play today, Especially because it's like all to the classical wolf armor. Farewell to King Bran, you a man in need. King's passing. Hold on, what was that? There is an occasion oh, worthy of sure be one worthy. One before who it could be no shame to lower. Hey there. Hello. Sorry to trouble you, but I really have no choice. What's up? What is it? Our ship was wrecked against the rocky shore June and the last storm. I've lost everything. How am I supposed to help? I haven't even got the coin for the journey home, and with each day's delay, I draw closer to bankruptcy. Mm -hmm. Might have guessed you'd come around to coin. So, need a loan? Or is it just alms you're after? I shall pay you back every last copper, I swear it. You need only call on me at my address in Novigrad. You know what? Go on, then. Fine. I'll help you. I visit Novigrad often enough. Might stop by, see how business is going. Thank you. You find me in the port district. My name's Johan Bonner. See you later then. Make a promise to a witcher and you'll sh uh, sharp make a mistake if you don't keep it. You mean to go back to work at the mill? Oh. oh, well, that's not good. Shit. You need not do this, child. I know, but I want to. Why is she going with him? What? Tis madness. Such a young lass. Berna should be the one going. They shared a bed longer. Silence. Tis her decision. What? Is this like some kind of till death do us part kind of mentality? What the fuck? You look beautiful. Thank you. Nice to see you again. The eulogy. King Bran of Clan Twirsech has embarked on his <laughs> final voyage. At its end. Our glorious ancestors await him. Together they will hunt and raid. They will sit round the fire and praise the deeds of ages past. For now, he lives in our hearts. One day, we too shall stand at his side and face the sea together. That Will be a good day. Oh, 
Loaded you a knew funeral. Bran. Yes, he was well respected. Unlike his wife. Skellige is its clans. In times of war, tradition holds the clans unite under the leadership of their king. We bid Bran farewell. Time to pick his successor who will lead us against the Black Ones. The In gates the of Caer Troll stand open to all who hail Bran of Clan Twirsach, dear. Twirsach. Mead and meat will be plentiful. During the wake, those who believe themselves worthy of the crown will step forth. Okay, this is fucking hype. Come to the wake with me. Gladly. Feasts in Skellige, so predictable. Slobbering drunks, brazen boasting, and the inevitable rows that result. Yo, don't yeah, talk shit, I'm enjoying like this. the banquets mages attend. Remember the one on Thanet? You were there. How could I forget? I also remember excruciatingly well what happened after the banquet. Stop reading my mind. Something to hide? Don't like secrets? No. God, you two. I'm trying to get immersed in the culture of this place, and these two are fucking flirting. Did you learn anything in Velen? Velen. Awful place. Somehow Ciri wound up at the castle of the local ruler, a baron, self-proclaimed. This was after she was injured. Injured? Was it serious? Don't think so. Must have recovered because this baron sent her on to Novigrad. Think she was looking for you at the time. These witches Ciri came across, she was lucky to escape them. Uh, witches? Creatures more like. Can't say exactly what they are, but they're dangerous. Very. Also ran into an old friend of ours in Velen, Kira. What on earth is Kira Metz doing in that wasteland? Hiding from witch hunters. Listen, she told me an elven mage had been there looking for Ciri. Oh yeah, that Good. I fucking killed her. You'll need to tell me more when we have some time. Been to Novigrad. Ciri was there, looking for a way to lift some curse. She's not there anymore. You're certain? Heard it from Dandelion, with no embellishments. Do you know any more about this curse? Not much. Siri ran into some trouble, never finished what she went there to do. I recovered a phylactery. She was looking for a way to enchant it. I'll look at it later. How about you? What have you learned? Something strange happened on Ard Skellig a time ago. A disaster brought about by a burst of magic. Aww. Extraordinary, really. Natural anomaly. Never seen anything like it. My intuition tells me Syria was its cause. As much as I respect your intuition, Yen, we need something specific. Evidence. I'd know for certain if I was able to inspect the disaster zone. Unfortunately, Ermion and his druids aren't letting anyone near. Hmm. Ermion's head of the Skellige Circle? Haven't seen him since... Um... Since Siri was a little girl. I doubt he'll do you any favors, not even for old time's sake. So why won't Ermion let you inspect the area of the anomaly? Call it a difference of opinion. A large, loud difference. Look, it's Krach. White Wolf! Greetings, Krach. Great White Wolf. I shall see you at the wake. And I'll not accept any excuses. I've an important matter to discuss with you. I shall wear black and white for the feast. I count on you to don something complimentary. Something that doesn't reek of a thousand hunts. Woo! Yen, you know I can't stand new doublets. Just too tight till you break them in. And just like Krak, I'll not accept any excuses. We're not here to enjoy ourselves. We've matters to resolve and should dress appropriately. See, I've rented a room at the inn. Took the liberty of laying out some clothes for you there. You ought to go. Choose something. In the meantime, I've something to attend to. We'll meet at the entrance to the feast hall. See, wouldn't they find, like, a, gr a great, like, combat outfit, like, respectful? Do they, do they care about formal gear in Skellige? Maybe I'm being racist. 
wait, it's me. I, I'm almost definitely being racist. This has got to be Yen's room. She always did like space and luxury. Holy shit. What the fuck? You have got to be joking me. The stuffed unicorn. She fixed it. Oh, I see that's from a previous game. No idea how she managed to bring so much clothing. Must have hired out a galleon. As <laughs> usual, black and white. Men. Glamour. Scent of lilac and gooseberries, even with the lid on. Oh, cool. Taste hasn't changed. Oh, is that from a previous game? Flaming. Gotcha. I'll not read her journal. That would just be... Yay! I can put away some shit. Oh. I can get put away in here. Also get put away in here. And that. And that. Let's see. Really should go to the shop at some point though. Sell some of this. You know the scene, of course. What's my chat do? Mary me, what the fuck? Her megascope? Guess she never goes anywhere without it. Uh. As Philippa Eilhart said, megascopes and toothbrushes. Deeply personal possessions. Did she fucking bring this whole place? All of this hers? Jesus Christ. Like me, a fucking hoarder. I guess I'll wear... I'll take my fucking mittens off. Specs an outfit like this? Okay. Oh. I heard Grey ain't a hogger. Wonder if he's as strong as he looks. Grand those swords, but I prefer we trust the axe. You're pale. Bye, drink last night. See, Lugos is fixing for a fight. And not with the black ones, but with us. If he breaks the trees, continental dandies come a strutting them. We gotta drag their corpses out of the inn. That caught a turn. Oh, they did him good. Cut his pouch open, pulled out his guts, something? and made him run around a tree till he ran out. I was assuming, oh, like, that is. Where kind did of... you hear that? What? What does this? What does this do? Jesus. Best blade's not worth shite if a weak arm's swinging it, eh? Very true.
Bran those swords. Let us pay but homage. Bran, 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 of Bran, of Bran was a great ruler. He needs a worthy successor. You speak as though you have someone in mind. Skellige's troubles very much derive from it not being a hereditary monarchy. Any upstart can be king and destroy his predecessor's legacy. The King of the Isles is a more symbolic position. What accent that is should that? should change as well. A strong leader who wields true power. That is what the times require. I'm trying to recognize what that accent is. Introduce me. This is my friend Geralt, and this is Berna, widow of the dear departed Bran. Is that just Scottish? The Queen Mother. Okay. It's a pleasure to meet you, Geralt. Oh, yeah, it you is. You must forgive me. But on a day like today, I'm afraid I cannot indulge in my penchant for long conversations. That's fair. I can see you chose your own outfit. You know, of course, that together we look about as good as lace frills on a battle axe. Excuse Everyone's me! Everyone's got their style. I picked out your fucking clothes that you set out for me! Fuck you! We should mingle before they all get drunk. There'll be no talking to anyone then. Good thinking. I don't know what Krach wants, but when we meet with him, we should have clear minds. I'm not gonna drink. Why dull my senses when I'm in such pleasant company? Do you plan to compliment me all evening? I do wish he'd stop, I yeah. I plan to tell you what I think. Bruh, we are going after the redhead, thank you very much. Stop getting confused. But no, also, fine. If you're gonna be a prat about it, I'm putting my fucking arm back on. I'll leave the mittens off at the very least. They're horrendously goofy. Oh, I need one more level and I can start wearing my cool new wolf armor, though. The king is dead. Long live the king. No guards, flagship. Isn't that gonna make me want to go play Crusader Kings, isn't it? So, what have you brought for the farewell feast? Just Bread, two long boats. sheep's milk cheese. Our wagon's sure. full of the loot. We ripped from the rat ones. We've barren. also wine from the temples of Italy. Remote ones. Geralt, there's something I've been meaning to ask you. So, <laughs> your beard. Why did you decide to grow it out? Don't really know. Hmm. Must say it suits you. Mm. Drink last night too. That's pretty funny, Fleming. Lady Yennefer. Sir. Greetings, Arnvald. My companion is Geralt of Rivia. Hey -oh. I am honored. Okay, see so he's Irish. Nice to meet you too. Quite a few guests. They come to bid their king farewell. They come to see the claimants to the crown. I, I think we wanted least. to talk to Croc on Crate. The Jarl will join us shortly. He's assigned you a place of honor at the table just beside his daughter Ceres. Follow me, please. I think he's Irish. That might be Scottish, though. I do get Scottish and Irish I mixed up quite too. easily. Wanted to meet the notorious Witcher Geralt. Yo, what up? We've met. Don't remember. That was ages ago. Yalmer and I were children when you last visited Orda. But you should meet your feast mates. Allow me the dubious honor. That's Halbjorn, son of Holger Blackhand. Hello. Blue boy Lucas, Madman Lucas' firstborn. Aye, aye. And choking down a stockfish over there is Otric on Hindar. I hope you don't expect me to remember these names. I'm terrible with names. Damn, she looks like she could put up a fight. Seems they set us with the sons of Jarls, exclusively. Ceres on Crate is the daughter of a Jarl, Geralt. Jarl's daughters are in no way inferior to their sons. Not Do my you intention. Know, every last one of them dreams of being Bran's successor. Look at him. Likely not. Ceres is jealous, for the one among us who performs the among us. feat will be crowned king. <laughs> we all know the feats are a sideshow. Our fathers will choose who will wear the crown. What do you think they spoke to Crack about? You talk like that because you're short of strength and skill. Um. Remember when Hjalmar challenged us all to a race up the mount? You didn't stand with us then. As he buried his axe in that stump at the top to mark his victory, you were warming your chicken bones by the fire. Had my reasons for not participating, but I would have won then, as I'd win now. Oh. Hmm. Now that you mention him, just noticed Hjalmar's not here. My brother walks his own paths. But about the race, why don't we repeat it? I'm willing to challenge any of you, Witcher included. 
If I beat him to the top, venture to say that'd be a feat, eh? So you're in. If the Witcher's in. Geralt? Uh, go on Gladly. then. What are the rules? Whoever pulls Hjalmar's axe from the stump at the top of the hill wins. Stray off the path and you lose. And here I was, ready to puke from all the boredom. Let's go! Let's go, yo! This is this is how fucking funeral should be. Have like big badass tests of strength and shit to cheer up the from mood. From this spot, you must reach the top of that mount. At the summit, you'll see the stump of an oak. Yalma's axe buried in it. Whoever pulls the axe from the stump first wins. I'm ready. You should have spent more time training and less you'll time applying your I makeup, the horn. darling. Not a shot. Show me what you've got, Monster Slayer. Oh, I like her. Oh god, now don't get distracted by the goats. My Skyrim brain is like, kill them. We need we need horns for the lights of home. Come on! Come on, Geralt! That's fucking dope, Bruce. That's the kind of shit I want at my funeral. Have a murder mystery uh, quiz at my funeral to lighten the mood. Uh, come on! Fucking hell. Come on! You can make it! Fucking hell, badass. Also, I stand by what I said. Yeah, they want people wearing kick-ass armor at their fucking funeral, not like, like Namby Pamby fucking fancy clothes. Let's go! I won, but only by a hair. No such thing. There's winning and there's losing, and I lost. We best go back to the week. Hey, you did Let's. well. Woohoo! So kick-ass though. Hell yeah. Uh, have See a, the wakes in full have a race with drones Last instead of chariots, you, Caitlin. Won. I lost. I lost to a witcher, Sparrowhawk. And it likely happened to any of us. Oh, that's and nice of to say. And let's drink. Drink! Can't today, for good reason, believe me. But if not today, then when? You've been great company. Sadly, it's time we moved on. Really? Indeed. We must talk, but not here. You shall learn all beyond that door. Oh boy. This sounds menacing, but alright. Well, I'm not gonna lie, I would have loved to have a drink with these folks. That's Shame. That's true. Why would I? The queen should join her king on his left. Tradition of the gods. Right, there's so much talking. Ah! This is why I don't go outside. Cross the wide somber sea. You're not there. Tell me, Lugos. Allow me to introduce I've not watched Geralt it yet, Rivia, no one a witcher. Uh, Bruce. Geralt, Yaldona and Hinda, and Yarl Madman Lugos. Hello there. Calling Lugos a madman's an insult to madmen. He's a common goat fucker. Wait. Call me a goat fucker one more time, and I'll chop off your head, stick it on a pike, and piss down your neck hole. Kindest Scotsman. Enough! Time to settle this. Here and now. Oh, ha, ha, ha. Giving me a true freight right now. Shat my best trousers. Put that away before you cut yourself, you cunt. <laughs> oh, I got me. I got me quite a bit. Take it outside, lads. Settle this outside. Who the fuck are you to advise me, eh? Someone with better manners. You insult Bran's memory and Crack's hospitality with this. <sighs> Emperor would be very pleased to hear you quarrel. His Imperial Majesty is more than welcome to visit. Let him sail over here. We ain't afraid of the Black Ones. Raiding coastal villages is one thing. Total war with the Empire is another. Off 
awfully mouty, this one. Go stir your cauldron and pierce some boils, witch. Don't <laughs> talk when you haven't got a fucking clue. That was the most British line ever put in a video game. <laughs> Settle it down. Calm down, Lugos. No one should teach me how to fight. That was not my intention. Come, Geralt. I believe this discussion's run its course. Fucking hell. What now? Now we pay a visit to Ermion's laboratory. Didn't know we'd been invited. Um. Because we've not been. Oh no. This is shady. I, I actually, no. Using a funeral to sneak around and like. Uh, I, I genuinely feel wrong about this. We shouldn't be breaking into Ermion's workshop. I if fucking I didn't adore know this armor kid. Yes. You needed to grow a pair. But I know that you simply enjoy complaining. It's the only reason you said that. Why would we go there? To retrieve an item. The Mask of Urboros. Uroboros! And therefore must steal it. <laughs> right. Of course. Come, Geralt. Fucking now hell. you'll tell me why you need this mask. Oh, I shall. In due course. Take it, you'll decide I when. Don't need Correct. anyone else. I have Uroboros. I've never heard it pronounced Herberus before. Footsteps. I'm gonna join him once I finish this stream, Rabbi. Shh. We'll actually Gods. be waiting onto him once he starts. Hide behind the tapestry. Sparrows chip, while starlings chirp. What do jackdaws do? Jackdaws call. <laughs> Goldfinches warble and cranes whoop. Grass peacocks screech. <laughs> Hawks scream, larks trill, and doves they coo. That's all of them. Hmm. <laughs> what about nightingales? All right, nightingales croon. Okay. The fuck were they wittering about? This will be tough to open. Surprises never end. See the ravens? Never more. Hard not to. Ermian spies. An indication that we're near his laboratory. I also sense a clear magic aura. Come. There's a ledge outside this window. We must pass along Come. it. Done this before? Nice. Seen uglier sights in my life. Geralt of Rivia being romantic. Whoa. Oh, that was you. Fucking hell. Stop that. Amazing how a hobby can render a man mysterious. Fascinating. Oh. Especially a druid. Oh. Must be a real nature lover. That's fucking dope. Had one at Kaer Morin. <laughs> Please. Looks alive. Okay, Geralt. A hundred loose and arrow if you saw that in the woods. Pause. A basin of water. For teleprojection, a reflection of Ermion appears on the surface. Supplicants speak to it. Hmm. That's fucking cool. Hmm. Yes? Yes? 
Yes, yes, yes. Okay, Fleming, I'll, I'll pay attention. Uh, is there anything else I should be investigating? Oh, I guess this door, but... Ah. Are you all right? Cut myself. The door is locked. What? Oh. The animals, they're alive. Yen, watch out. Um. Monsters. Can feel them coming closer. They're everywhere. Is he drugged? Come on. Oh, the, there's like a poison on the door. Strange. Smells of mushrooms in here. Yeah, he's been drugged. To my mind, it's the scent of sweet drugs trying to Oh, fuck. Yeah, look, he's already taken damage. It wouldn't be a good party if he wasn't. <laughs> oh my god, fuck up. And... Little help here. Really appreciate it. What's happening? You were hallucinating. You ran at Ermion's animals, sword flailing. I had to calm you. <laughs> we shall never speak of this again. Mind if we uh, never mention this again? Naturally. Doors open. We'll proceed as soon as you've collected trophies of your kills. Oh. Oh, Jesus. Inside, oh, no. Well, then. Well, there goes the hope of managing this as a stealth mission. They're going to get in I'll the shit the when he comes back. We don't want to raise suspicions. Um, but... But the animals. Ah, our dear Ooh, druid's whoops. laboratory. We must search it thoroughly. The mask of Urboros must be Ooh, here. Skelliger's tales about the wild hunt. The islanders oh. believe the wraith sail on a longship built of the claws of dead men. Oh, that's fucking dope. For this very reason, superstitious Skelligers remove the nails of their dead expressly to prevent them from being used to fortify this ghastly ship. That's fucking awesome. Wondrous I world of insectoids. Ritual plants. Ah, what do you know? Raymond Marlove. A biography enhanced. I love when people like go through the work of making it so that their laws has like reasons behind it. That's fucking cool. A letter bearing Ermian's seal to the druids warns them about you. For the druids, before one of the sorcerers arrived on Erdska Lake named Yennefer, she hails from Vengerberg. Though you're immune to feminine wiles and will not let a well-draped skirt muddle your reasoning, nevertheless, I warn you not to be taken by intelligence and refinement. I know who she is. I do not however know the true goal of her stay here. I see no point in asking her this first directly for Yennefer is known for her cutting and eloquence. There's not what she thinks, what she, but what she wishes you to hear. You must remember there's no second-rate sorceress. The person who breaks bread with the rulers of the north and who's worked with the Nilgardian Emperor himself. Familiar with courts of the world over, she possesses the ability to manipulate that even the wilds differ. Yo, dude, fucking suck her food a dick more, why don't you? Jesus! She has displayed an unhealthy interest in the site of the cataclysm. We're striving to study. I've not given her permission to go near it, but I caution you to keep your eyes and ears open all the same. The sorceress is a stubborn and effective manipulator. I know that in the past, her and Crack's paths crossed. I expect you'll wish to settle friendship for some purpose. Alrighty then. Jesus Christ. That Quite scared of brazen about. manipulator. Yeah. <laughs> the shameless schemer. Seems Ermian has real tobacco brought in. Ooh, nice. Alright, let's wrap up this little scene. Dwarven triple mead. Of no Goes in for light reading, too. The Corpse of Novigrad by Sasha Hadi. Oh, it's a novel. Laboratory worthy of an Imperial alchemist. Yes. A goat carved out of Lindenwood, oh, signed to Uncle Ermion. Little Ciri's handiwork. 
That's what she called him when he was her tutor. Oh. She knew him? Oh, well, there you go. Oh. Oh. The white. Well, there we go, then. Yeah, I did get a message there. Um, that's something we can lean on. If he cares about Siri, too, we can try and, like... Child skull. Oh. That's pretty fucked. We can lean on that. Oh. Pinecone. Didn't expect this. A large female. Hermion's wand. Hmm. He's one of the few druids to use one. Lord. A sword in a stone. Things begging me to pull it out. It's not in the stone, don't you see? It's held there by a vice. Hmm. Rats. And a map. Look Accurate. at this. A detailed map of the northern kingdoms. Even shows spheres of influence over the ages. Ooh, that's out of cool. date. Oh, yeah, I figured it would be, but, you know, still, it's interesting. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Looks like Ermion places something in the statue's hand. The skull. So, statue, how about a skull? Hmm. Guess you're no indecisive prince. Aha! A pine cone, perhaps? He is a druid. What do you say we give it a pine cone? Hmm, nothing. Wait, the mead? Really? Fucking alcoholic. How about a mug of mead? Statue or not, everybody needs a drink sometimes. No fucking way. Huh, seems like it worked. Who would have thunk? The one that I would have guessed the least. enjoys jests achieved at the expense of others. I have a sneaking suspicion the mask will be in here. Speed. Right, let's track down this mask before we finish up. Oh, that doesn't look good. This is it. Jennifer. I don't want you to get fucking Dumbledore by that thing. Be careful. Check for curses. Oh. Oh. We've got it. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm just, I'm just waiting for, uh, hold on, hold on. Uh. Oh, what's that? What's the meme with the dog, the anime dog girl? Um. Uh, when Corona was playing fucking, uh, but Ikan Bokum, Ikan Bokum. We must return to the feast quickly before. Oh, hello! I killed one of you earlier. Hello, Clayface. I learned this. It's a trap. We're in prison. Great. Ikan Bokum. Ow. <laughs> Let's go. Geralt, hear that? Oh, Smart. we're being gassed. Yes. Great, still closed. Gotta think of something quick. Um, um, I can't burn it out. Um, 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 um. 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 Uh. The damn druid will poison us. This vapor's deadly. We've got but a few minutes. Teleport us out of here. Think of something. Quickly. First thing to come to your mind. But we're dying! Hold on tight.
I'm romancing the redhead, Kevin. <clears throat> Sorry, folks. <laughs> I got a bit lost. No, heed my words. There is no greater act of valor than to fight a beast cursed by men and gods. No greater deed than that done to serve the goddess. A good point. Words of uncommon beauty. We thank you. And we'll take them to heart. But now, let's begin. We have seen Bran off to the beyond and must now choose his successor. A king must be wise. A king must command respect. A king must have bollocks. <laughs> We've no lack of men like that. I like these guys. Let those who feel worthy of the throne of Skellige step forth. Yo, I want to step forth. Do it, do it, do it. Come on. Nice. My son could not be here this day. Behold his axe. Behold his will. This is good sound design. I like this. Let's go. May the best man a woman win. Woo! What's got into her? She's your daughter, is she not? Now I know why she said she'll sail to speak her og. Ah, children. The older they grow, the more trouble they are. True. Come with me. All the more essential we talk now. How was it, Geralt, when Ciri was nearing womanhood? I remember well her nan, her mother, what they were like. They say the apple doesn't fall far from the tree. Ciri was impossible to control. No telling her what to do. Had to have things her own way almost always. Why do you ask? No specific reason. She and Ceres, they're of a similar age. But we'll speak of my children later. First, let's speak of yours. Yennefer claims Ciri's in trouble, and you seek her. That's right. If you require aid, gold, ships, anything, Merely say the word. I'll give you all I can. Oh, what a lot. And I know the last lives. I'm sure of it. When the blood of Rhiannon's daughters is shed, the sea grows white with fury. I'd mark such a storm. Magic anomaly on Ord Skellig somehow related to Ciri, or so Yennefer believes. It's my strong suspicion. But I can only know for certain by examining the site. I saw the twisted forms. Right on natural. The druids were barely able to contain it. Explain to me, Yennefer, how Ciri might have caused this great catastrophe. I'm intent on learning that very thing. Which I will do as soon as Ermion stops hindering my investigation. Don't concern yourself with him. Druids have little trust for mages. But Ermion's heart is in the right place. Am I right to assume he does not know you seek Ciri? It's of no concern to him. Except it As is. As I thought. At any rate, Art Skellig's my isle. You have my permission to investigate as you see fit. Thank you. No need. I swore an oath once. I aim to keep it. Anvold! Tell the druid I must speak to him, at the usual spot. 
I have one more matter to broach. My... Wow, an authority figure that won't make me jump through hoops to do something that's clearly in his interest too. Thank fuck. Children. You remember Yalma? Well, he swore an oath to kill the giant of Undik. Set off and has yet to return. But as Ceres announced, that she's to set off on an adventure of her own. Got it in her head that Udalric is not mad, but cursed. Hmm. Take it Ceres wants to lift the curse. There's no curse to speak of. Ceres has decided she must match Yalmar and sort out a deed worthy of a queen. Think she might need my help? You did plan to ask me for it. Why? The thing is, I don't trust Ulrich further than I can spit. Ceres won't listen to me, or her brother. Yet confronted by a professional who will explain why she's mistaken, she just might come to her senses. That's so, fair. yes, I ask that you explain things to her and bring her back. Hmm. Potentially. Can't help wondering. Got no plans to vie for the crown yourself? Think a good number of the Jarls would support you. A good number? Those opposed would be fierce, rabid. Madman Lugas would sooner see an elf guardian on the throne. Besides, a man should know when to step aside. Hand the tiller to the youth among us. Among us. But also a very, very good philosophy. This man is already one of my favorite characters and he's only been on screen for like five minutes. <laughs> Giants. They had been extinct for ages. Anyone actually seen the one on Undvik? Aye. Dozens of refugees have. The giant drove everyone off the isle. I've welcomed what remains of Clan Tordorach here on Artsgeleid. I heard a rumor that an unnatural frost gripped Undvik before the giant appeared. It's true. Oh. At any rate, Yalmar decided to kill the giant and give the isle back to its people. A deed... Were they of a king, he believes? It is. My son gathered a hearty crew at the new port. They were to sail to Unvik, then travel on foot to Oska, the village. But that many lads should have killed the giant long ago. Thus, I thought to ask you. You should start at the new port. Ask around. Hjalmar might have told someone there his plans. Yeah. If either Hjalmar or Ceres need help, I'll help them. I thank you. Well, now that we're done thanking one another, let's get to work. We must determine if Siri is still on Ardskellig. Aye. I'll change into travel attire and find you. Head south. The anomaly we should investigate destroyed a stretch of forest along the shore of the bay. A successful feast on all counts, Krak. I will see you later. God! Can you women not just walk somewhere normally? I make fun. If I could teleport, I'd do it fucking everywhere too, but... Uh...